Hey everybody, Tim and Julie here for another Batman 1966 video, Season 2, Episodes 45 and 46. The Batman anniversary, a riddling controversy. For one, it is so weird to get into like episodes that high in a single season. Just because, like for me growing up, seasons usually went to like 26 episodes tops. Uh, and nowadays they're like 13 episodes. Like seasons are so short. But, like, the fact that we're still in the same season and we're on episode 46 is ridiculous. It's so long. 14 more to go. Yeah, we're, we're almost there. We're almost done. Um, so for this one, which I looked it up and I'm a little sad. Because it's all about, like, the Batman anniversary and stuff. Like, realistically, a few episodes ago, the, the Zodiac one with the Joker was actually the one-year anniversary for Batman the series. Because it started in, 60, like, January 66. The Zodiac was January of 67. Mm -hmm. So that was actually the Batman anniversary. So this one, I, I don't know. Because it would have been great if it had been the same. Right. And then also the Riddler was the first villain in the series. Mm -hmm. So... What did you think about this one? And then for this one, Frank Gorshin, who has been the Riddler the entire time, was under a like a pay dispute. It always comes down to money. It, he was under a pay dispute. And so they were like, fuck you. And they replaced him. And John Astin, mm -hmm. who I, I like John Astin. Yeah, he's good. Um, like, I mean, everything from the uh, Gomez and the Adams Family, who is now the third Adams Family actor, because we saw Carolyn Jones mm -hmm. as Marsha. We saw one of the window cameos of um, Lurch. Right. And now John Aston playing the Riddler. So what did you think of this this story? And what did you think of John Aston instead of Gorshin? It was... I liked it. I mean, the, the way they got Batman and Robin down. Mm -hmm. You know... Um, Commissioner Gordon said, "Oh, you can't come to the office." Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. You when it's a surprise. Come, yeah, you gotta come wherever it was, Pitt. Yeah, uh, it was it like was some, some banquet hall. Banquet hall. And he opened it up, and there was all these people in there. And congratulations. Mm -hmm. Which I don't think they actually said like how like what anniversary it was. No. Like it was a two year or a three a ten year who knows. Yeah. But that was nice, the way they did it. Um, I kind of like Frank Gorshin. Better. As, yeah, mm -hmm. as the Riddler. And, I mean, John Aston didn't do too bad. But... For me, I think it's just, like, I'm familiar with Gorshin. Mm -hmm. Like, if it had been... John Aston from the beginning. From the beginning, yeah. I mean, and even if they had swapped, like let's say it was John Aston the entire time, and then in this season John Aston was a paid dispute, so they got Frank Gorshin. Uh -huh. Like I would have been like, oh, he's pretty good, yeah. but like I'm so used to John Aston, but right. it's it was weird. Yeah. But I did think he did very good, and as you know, I love to watch like classic. 60s, 70s, 80s game shows. Uh -huh. So John Aston and Patty Duke, Duke right. show up all the time. So it's it's great to just kind of see John Aston as the Riddler. Yeah. Because I felt more like familiar with him mm -hmm. because of game shows and Gomez and stuff. Yeah. But. Some of his jokes <laughs> weren't no, no, they weren't that good. But... Mm -hmm. And that's where because we both had to sit there. Okay, that last joke when they, Batman and Robin were in the car, mm -hmm. and they were talking about this last, the last joke, the last riddle, wanting to know uh, what the other three were. Oh we right, and we were like, what were what they? What were yeah. they? And then they started talking about mm -hmm. it, and it made sense. Yep. But the underwater fight. Oh, God, that, that, yes. I thought we were get, seeing moments of that last fight with Robin. It was picking, so long. It was, 
Yeah. And it was, I mean, realistically, for being 1967, it wasn't bad. But you're, like, just watching it, especially, like, today, like, if you're an actor and the script's, like, underwater fight, they're putting you underwater. Mm -hmm. And you could tell. They were just, like, okay, they filmed it normally and just slowed it down and they put a screen over it to make it look fuzzy. Mm -hmm. Oh, God, it was awful. <laughs> it was so bad. Yeah. Just watching them try to do this fight underwater. But, um... Then getting um, lured up into the giant cupcake. Mm hmm The, you know, the quicksand the cake. Quicksand. And they had to use their something bat. Something Rocket boots. Boots to slow down and, you know, when they got to a certain level, then it activated and mm -hmm. into there. But we got to see... It looks like a new Batcopter. Yeah, and that's, then the, I couldn't tell that you one. You were in the in the other room when the, they sh rolled up on the new, uh, looked new because it was white. Okay. And um, Bat Cycle. Which, I don't know, that could be just them, like, trying to get ready. Because, I mean, the new season was right around the corner at this mm -hmm. point. Yeah. The the backcopter, I couldn't tell if that was new or not. Like, because it kind of looked like the movie. Mm -hmm. Which, I mean, at this point, it had been a while. So they could have just re redecorated it or whatever. Mm -hmm. um, yeah, a lot of new stuff for those ones. Right. Which, yeah, we got... I mean, realistically, every episode's a duo, so yeah, we got like seven, seven more, and then we're done with season two. Yeah. And season three will be a blink of the eye compared to season two. I feel like we've been in season two forever. Yes, we have. Um, okay. Uh, any other closing, closing comments for this one? No, it it was actually pretty good. It just, I don't know, because he didn't really. Well, he did. You know, steal the money. St stole the what? The first thing he stole was the oh, the calf, the, the golden, golden calf. calf. Yep. That the money was raised to for, mm. for help, and then the oh, what was funny? The the scientist that mm. showed him the oh, the the pen, the, the forty nine cent pen. Yeah. The, mm -hmm whatever well it's worth whatever it was amount and he's john aston or the regular goes yeah it looks like a cheap 49 cent pen or something like that mm -hmm. you know? but, but yeah it was it was good it was i liked it all right um i guess that's it okay yeah I don't know. Would you want to see John Aston keep going, or do you want to see yeah. Frank Gorshin come back? Nah, probably a little both. Little. Little. Just switch back and forth. Yeah. Um, do you think of them as the same character or different characters? Different. Okay. Yeah. Because that's the thing about like this classic Batman is you never really hear about the villains. Like, secret identity. Like, you never, in this whole series, hear Selina Kyle. You only right. hear Catwoman. Right. Uh, for the Riddler, you never hear Edward Nigma. You only hear the Riddler. You never hear Cobblepot. You just hear the Penguin. So, I mean, realistically, like, it doesn't have to be the same Riddler. So, right. who knows? Um, so, for those who have seen it, what did you guys think comparing Frank Gorshin to John Aston? What did you think about the underwater fight? I don't think it's actually a spoiler. I guess it's a spoiler. I don't know. I don't really care. I've had too much today. Um, this is the last time we see... This is the first and last time we see John Aston. We will see the Riddler again next season. And he is once again played by Frank Gorshin. So it's like this... Which just makes this episode even weirder. That it's right. just this one time of John Aston. So what did you guys think about it? My Probably my favorite part is the telegram scene where he's like, is somebody here named Batman? The dude dressed as a bat. It kind of reminded me of the Lego one where he's like, Batman, is that a last name? One word, like Madonna. Like I love, like that's what it reminded me of. Telegram. So what did you guys think of that? What did you think of the Batcopter? What did you think of everything? Go ahead, let us know. Thank you guys for watching. Thank you guys for subscribing. And we will see you guys next time for... The Joker's Last Laugh and The Joker's Epitaph.